Hey everyone, it's Jahaya. Welcome back to Truck It, our trucking channel where we show you all of our growing pains and learning experiences in this trucking industry. Today, as you can see in our title, I'm going to be sharing with you roll-up door versus swing doors because they be there is a difference, okay? So um, just going to go ahead and jump right in. Uh, we started our trucking industry back in May and we started with just the power unit because we were originally running with someone else and we were renting a trailer. So when we got our own authority and we decided let's go ahead and get a trailer because it was a little harder for us at that time being a new authority to get power only loads and we had bills and expenses coming out so we needed to get something quickly so we went online uh looking for um trailers and we found one at a good rate um it was a reefer trailer and we was like yes let's get it it had a roll-up door so we was like oh this is gonna be perfect for everyone they're gonna love it so we went down and we purchased this trailer and then once everything was said and done we got our tags titles everything was done we started looking for loads so we looked for loads and we found our first reefer load we booked it and then i got the raycon and it said swing doors only and my heart <laughs> my heart just dropped and i called them back and i was like oh this says swing doors and we have a roll-up door and they were like nope no can do and they dropped me off of that load guys i was dropped i was heartbroken and not only did they drop me that was my first time with this company they like banned me for months <laughs> i could not book with them because they said i agreed to a load and i did not complete that load so they would not book with me for months guys all right so i just want to let you all know if you all have the option, which you guys should, of a swing door and a roll-up door, choose a swing door. Most of the um, most of the brokers out here, most of the companies out here, they only want a swing door. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you, we have been thugging it out with the roll-up door. Um, there are some companies that will accept it. There are some loads that will accept it, but it is harder. Uh, to find. I actually just recently, yesterday, um, had an issue with my roll-up door and I had to cancel the load. Um, there has been times where I have gotten up to, they may have not, they may not have spe uh, specifically asked for it in the Raycon, the rate confirmation, um, that they needed the uh, swing doors. And once we got to the actual uh, load, they couldn't take take us with our roll-up door. And I think one of the reasons why is because sometimes those pallets are stacked really high. And with the roll-up door, you do lose maybe six inches to a foot, um, but it really makes a difference to them and they, they, they just won't take you. So if you have the option between a swing door and a roll-up door, please, 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 do the swing doors. It will save you so much trouble, so much trouble at the end, okay? So when you're going to purchase your trailer, remember Jahaya said, get a swing door. Nobody wants a roll-up door. Get a swing door, all right? All right, that's just my little gem for today. I hope everyone is having a great day. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, and click your notification bells. I will be bringing you all more uh, details from our growing pains and our learning experiences, and hopefully my experiences will help you out in the long run. All right, talk to you all later. Bye.